Hi, I'm Daniela Elliott. Hi, I'm Michael Riccio. Today, we're going to propagate basil through cuttings. And grow Hawaiian chili peppers through seed. If you ever had an issue with your basil getting really old and woody, well, there's a solution for that. You can propagate it again via cuttings. Or if your neighbor has a plant and you just want to take a clipping, you can do that. So just cut right here below the node. And now we're going to teach you how to do that. So you will need a knife, the cutting, some potting media, and a pot. Now that you have your cutting, what you should do is remove the leaves. So you can use a sharp knife or you can use your fingers to remove most of the leaves. You don't want to remove them all, but definitely the bigger leaves. And the reason for that is we're kind of helping the plant not lose too much water. You also want to cut the flowers. So remove those flowers so the plant doesn't send all its energy towards the flowering tip because what we want are actually leaves. Okay, now you have your cutting and that cutting should have several nodes. So the node is that area one, two, and three. So it's good to go. And what you wanna do is move your potty media into your pot and let it be nice and loose. You don't need a lot of, um, you don't need to compress too much. So once you have it, you can tap it just a little bit, then place your seedling inside and what some people like to do is um, pinch it a little bit just to make it nice and firm. And then, of course, you want to water it. So there's your cutting. So in a couple weeks, your cutting is going to look like this. And it will be ready to go into a pot or into the ground. And you're good to go. Okay, now we're going to show you how to propagate Hawaiian chili pepper through seed. First, let's take a look at the stages of the fruit for the Hawaiian chili pepper. First, we have the flower, and then the flower will turn into these little bulbs that will slowly turn from light green to a vibrant red, and that's the one you want. Now, these are the things you'll need in order to plant your seed. Gloves, knife, the fruit itself, and potting media. All right, first, what you want to do is grab your knife. Cut the fruit, exposing the seeds within. And what you can do actually with the seeds is use them now or place them on a paper towel to dry and save for later. Now you can grab your potting media, place the seed on the tip of your finger, put the seed in the pot, pinch the soil around it, and then water. And in about 10 to 14 days, you should see seedlings emerging. We hope you enjoyed the video. Bye. Aloha.